when the idea first invaded my mind, can I do a million works of art, I was ignorant about how to do that. I was ignorant about whether I could do that. And as I've gone to my studio and worked throughout the day, put one foot in front of the other, put one hand in front of the other, I've gained knowledge about how to build the tools to do that, what sort of paint, all of these things have basically transformed an ignorant point of view to a point of view of knowledge. And it's the same with the stigma of mental health. When I first started as a mental health nurse, I had a large amount of ignorance about what it's like for people, what are those people like and what it's like for them. And over the years of working in the hospital and being taught by a lot of people who have mental illness, for lack of a better term, mental illness, and mental wellness, and being and having my own experience of being around those people, this void of not knowing has been filled somewhat with a knowledge of what those people are like. What's their life like for them? How does mental illness impact on them? How does it make them vulnerable in the world? So rather than talk about blame and stigma, I think simply it's a matter of a changing a position of not knowing to gaining experience and then knowing. And I think they'll be really surprised. <laughs>